Fable's first fall scent has officially came out. The Harvester. Come harvest these up in your hands. <laughs> Eyes up here, up here, not down here on this nice new tea Colin sent over to me from Fable Beard Company, and that's who we are with today with his newest fall scent, first to come out this year. That is The Harvester, and The Harvester has got some fantastic artwork as usual, and it is a spiced apple cider, ripe pumpkin, and fall breeze scent from Fable Beard Company. And as usual, he uses his uh, set uh, blend. He uses coconut oil, castor oil, jojoba oil, argan oil, sweet almond oil, and fragrance oils. And uh, talking to Colin, he's trying to make a little bit more of a move of all the fragrance oils. There's just more possibilities while using fragrance oils in your blends uh, set-wise, which is how I believe he got this bad boy right here. This is a fantastic, fantastic scent. And yeah, it's to me, it's almost all all apple cider. I don't get too much of the pumpkin. I definitely get that that fally sense about it, but it's all all apple cider. To me, maybe light pumpkin. I've worn this for about a week. I noticed maybe very light light pumpkin, but to me, it's just all apple cider. And I'm an apple cider fan, so this is a win of a fall scent to me. If that is something you are into. And as usual, we've got his medium, definitely medium to medium to light consistency. Definitely more and more on the medium side there. And that is just a fantastic scent for the first one to come out this fall. Talking to Colin, I asked, hey, it came early. I know I wasn't with Fable last fall. I said, I, I'm hearing this, is, this came out early. Does that mean it's going to leave early? It's going to leave before fall's over maybe. And he said it's a good possibility. So jump on it while it's here. It's a great scent. I know any fall fan, any apple cider fan will really like this. And a lot of these people just like to collect because of the characters. The, the characters are fantastic with Fable. And I've got the, uh, the butter here. Nice beard hair hanging out in there. And yeah, it's just the same, same apple cider heavy scent here with a nice, nice texture. I love Fable's butters. Um, I've had a lot of people ask me, you know, they, they don't use butter or they only use butter at night and their balm just, it doesn't feel nourishing to them, uh, whether it's with Fable or any other company they're telling me. Um, and they asked me, what about butter during the day? I am a big, big fan of butter all the time. I rarely use a balm. I only use a balm if somebody sends it to me, wants a review on it, wants my opinion on it. Other than that, I'm butter all day, every day from any company. I love butters over balms all day. Uh, Fables, it's a good option if you're looking for a butter with a little bit of a hold. This is this will definitely cover you uh, over a balm if you want to just switch to butter all day. Butters do a great job of holding in the hydration in your beard, sealing it up after you use your oil. Uh, recommend using your oil. Wait five minutes, smack that butter in there. And Fable is a great option. Uh, his butters have the mango butter, cocoa butter, cocum butter, Illip nut butter, shade butter, beeswax, fragrance oils. That beeswax will give you a little bit of a hold there. And that is just a fantastic butter. Uh, the oils, as usual, the harvester is no different, even though it's a limited scent, it is only 18 bucks for an oil, which is definitely within range of price range for a one ounce oil. And his butters, I believe, are 24, 25 for a butter, but I know if you get the uh, oil and butter together, it's 38 bucks, not a bad deal for, that's that's just the average price for all of his butter off of the CBD line, but this is, like I said, a limited time scent, so if you're gonna go ahead and jump on the oil, I would highly recommend getting the butter if that's the route you like, or the balm. The oil and balm, 36 bucks, so just a couple bucks difference, depending on what you like. Great, great scent for the first fall scent to come out from Fable. And also, I have got the Foreman, which was last month's monthly subscription scent. And this is a cedar, sandalwood, patchouli, and leather scent. This is a super, super manly scent. 
Uh, I don't need to touch on it too much because it's not available anymore, but I will touch on what is next to be available on the monthly subscription. The foreman, just give you guys a little heads up of what to expect if you do get uh, onto the monthly subscri <laughs> subscription. And yeah, that's just a manly, manly, manly scent. Definitely the patchouli stands out the most to me. And then followed up by the leather and cedar. Uh, I get a little bit of sandalwood, but it's not overpowering. So I really, I really like this one. I'm hit and miss with sandalwood, but the patchouli, leather, and cedar definitely stand out in the foreman. And he uses, uh, he had a little bit of essential oil in this one. But as usual, it's all his same carrier blends. Fantastic stuff. I love this. And yeah, this was July's monthly subscription scent. Next coming out is a good friend of mine's uh, character. He finally got his character to come out and that will be the Greaser. The Greaser's coming out with a good buddy of mine named Logan. Uh, it's going to be a sweet orange, creamy vanilla shake scent. And it's kind of got an old, uh, old uh, sports car vibe to it, muscle car vibe to it, along with like a, a drive-in, uh, milkshake theater or a, uh, a restaurant, an old school milkshake restaurant vibe to it. Uh, very cool, very neat. Um, I'm excited for Logan for that to come out. You can still get on the monthly subscription if that sounds good. That sweet orange, uh, creamy vanilla shake, if that sound, sounds good to you, that is definitely something you could still jump on if you signed up. I think it's before the 24th. The 24th, if you sign up, you will be included in that monthly subscription package. So that's something you could jump into. Uh, I've touched on uh, details before of that. Um, you really, if you order uh, the oil, I believe the butter, the co-wash, and I think there's a balm for it, uh, you end up saving like 17 bucks. 17 bucks total for all those versus if you were just to order something like, you know, the harvester. If you want something different that nobody else has like the foreman, you can't find this on the website, if you're interested in something like that, you're saving about 17 bucks if you just go ahead and order everything. If you don't want everything, uh, I know the the oils are for sure 18 uh, a month. I think I pay 21 bucks a month, and that's all I get is the uh, the oil here. But it's an oil nobody else has unless you're a monthly uh, subscription subscriber. So that's an option for you. Um, if you're interested in Fable's False Sense or any of his CBD line, as usual, my code works, SKINNY15, gets you 15% off everything but the merch. I can't get you 15% off of this. Uh, just comes through a third-party company. They got to pay them. They got to ship it to you. Uh, I got this in about two to three weeks. So if you're ordering any merch from Fable, give it a little bit of time. Everything's a little slow uh, during these times. But go check them out. They've got great stuff up on there. First of the fall sense, talking to Colin, there's tons, tons, tons more coming out this fall, especially Halloween. I wish I could tell you what's coming out in Halloween, uh, but I can't. Call it would take his shirt back and not be friends with me anymore. So go check them out. Fable, as usual, Skinny 15, save you 15% off your entire order. Go check them out, guys. Love you. We'll take it easy. Everybody stay safe.